It's in the book. Huh? Yeah, yeah. It's just, just, you can, with pencil, you can put circles or draw lines or anything. <clears throat> Brother, I have to again tell you something. That numbers will come with practice. Hmm? The more we practice, the more fluent you will become. And in every language, the numbers are a bit complicated in every language. If you happen to know English and you say numbers because you have been doing it from your childhood. Uh, uh, some of you speak other languages. I can speak a little bit of Urdu, Gujarati, Sindhi, Kachi. I can speak a little bit. Some of you can speak Punjabi, you know, and, and Soheli. Uh, the thing is that they are complicated, but because you grew up with it, you don't feel the difference. But if you were to teach somebody, it's not easy. I have had many instances in the bookstore, brothers and sisters, people come, they speak Urdu, but when I count in Urdu, he said, don't count in Urdu. I don't understand. Yeah. And it has happened to me with Gujarati. They speak fluent Gujarati with me. And when I speak, uh, when I count numbers in Gujarati, no, no, don't count. <laughs> I don't understand. You know, it means, you know, one has to have a practice. So, <clears throat> inshallah, we'll practice. Or if some of you will go to Middle East, uh, in in few days' time, it will all come to you. Okay. Now another thing about eleven to nineteen. Everything is mabni fixed on fata. Are you with me? Everything is mabni on fata. Do you realize that? Eleven to nineteen. Huh? There are no dhammas, no kasras. Everything is mabani. When you say mabani, and if you have to describe it in grammar, how will you say? Mabani yun ala fata fi mahalli. Whatever the situation is, is it coming as a mafulun bihi, then nasbin? If it is coming as a uh, majroor, then fi mahalli jarrin? And if it is coming as a file or mubtada or something, you will say, fi mahali rafin. Except the first part of 12. What is the first part of 12, brothers and sisters? Hmm? And, and one more. Now this is not babani. It is mu'arab. Huh? What you call it? Mu'arab. Mu'arabun. Means it declines. But the declension is of dual. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? How does the dual decline? Huh? Uh, if I put noon here, then you will say if nani and then if naini, if naini. If I put noon here, you will say if natani. If nataini, if nataini. But because there is no noon here, what will you say now? If nai. What will you say? Is nai and is nai. Huh? Okay, keep that in mind, brother. And here it will be is natai and here again will be again it is all beautifully explained in the key. Brother, if it is isna, it is marfu. What is the sign of marfu? Alif. If it is nai, it can be mansu. Or Majroor. What is the sign of Mansub and Majroor? Yeah. Huh? If you remember that, then you are doing beautiful, brother. So, again you will remember, and in book three, we will be doing analysis also. Okay. So, 11 to 19, the first part is Murakkab. 
or compound consist of two. Okay? Everything is mabni on fatah except first part of twelve. Huh? These things are to be understood and you know kept in mind. So number eleven and twelve the 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 other matches the Mahdud. If it is Muzakkar, it is all Muzakkar. If it is Mornas, it is all Mornas. Then, brothers and sisters, from 13 to 19, the second part matches the Mahdud. The first part is opposite. So if you say, Thalathata Ashara Taliban, what is matching with Taliban? Ashara, which is second part. What about Thalathata? It is opposite. Huh? This we have to keep it in mind. All the way up to 19. And if I say Talibatan, then I'll say Salasa Ashrata Talibatan. So what is matching with Talibatan? The second part, Ashrata. The first part is opposite. This thing has to be kept in mind. Right? And brothers and sisters, up to 19. After 19, draw a line. Then we have to come to 20. Number 20. We make this as a group. Because in this group, we will add 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, and 90. What do we call these numbers? Okay. Now, brothers and sisters... This is on the pattern of Jama, Muzakkar, Salim. So, Ishruna, it is Marfu, Bilwaw. If I make it Mansub, it will become Shreen. And if I make it Majroor, it will be Ishreen. See, same way as Mudarisuna, Mudarisina, Mudarisina, Muslimuna, Muslimina. Muslimina, Mominuna, Mominina, Mominina. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? So this is a separate group. Huh? And in this group will be 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, and 90. They will have same pattern. So let us see what can we say from our memory. Ishruna, then 30. Thalathuna, 40. Arbauna, 50. Hamsuna, 60, Situna, 70, Sabauna, 80, Samanuna, 90, Tisauna. And we will decline the way we decline Jama, Muzakkar, Salim. Okay. Now the next group, brothers and sisters. The next group is from 21 to 29. And if you understand 21 to 29, then it is the same with 31 to 39, 41 to 49, 51 to 59, 91 to 99. It will be the same pattern. Again, brothers and sisters, please pay attention. Number 21 and 22. Everything will match. Adad will match with Madud. The only difference is the wow, ataf comes after one. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Wahidun. Wa ishruna. Okay? And then Taliban. When it comes to ishruna, ukudun, it does not change with gender. It remains same. Ishruna Taliban and Ishruna Talibatan. So, Wahidun wa Ishruna Taliban. And then, Ithnani wa. Now, you see, proper Ithnani plus wa wa Ishruna Taliban. Take it into a modernist side, Talibatan. We say, Ihda wa Ishruna Talibatan. And then Isnatani Vaishruna Talibatan. Are you with me, brothers and sisters?